Hey guys, what's going on? It's me Nathan. Just want to say uh, good evening, everyone, both the East West Coast. Hope you guys are enjoying. Hope you guys enjoyed your day today. Here on Thursday, you guys are also uh, looking forward to the uh, weekend coming up, starting tomorrow on Friday. And for this video tonight, of what I want to talk about is how did you know it's seen the last of Travis? So let's go right into it. The link will be in the description down below. This is from uh, soaphub.com, uh, posted by Ashley uh, Sapienti for the 14th of July of 2016. It was posted today here on Thursday and it says. Travis, played by Michael Rourke, sold his bar and plans to sail, sail around the world on the Unrustless. He's getting his bags ready and moving on whether or not Vicky uh, comes with him. Does today mark the end of his short run with the show? Leaving on a sailboat? It seems Rourke is packing in his dressing room as well, at least for now. The actor took to social media today to say goodbye and thank his wine our friends. Quote, Travis says goodbye and sails out of town. Thank you fans, cast, and crew. However, he left the fans with some hope that we haven't seen the last of him. Quote, Will he come back for his girl? He teased. Does, it, does, uh, does this mean he can return later down the road? What about Vicky? The unlikely relationship between a Silver Spoon Newman and a lonely bartender captured fans' ima imaginations. There was something new and exciting about Victoria's Amelia Henley new view. Although it, doesn't, it didn't last long, it was nice to see Vicky happy with someone other than Billy. Rumor has it she may end up back with Billy, Jason Thompson after all. The two have started to reconnect and bond over their children. But Phil's out of the picture, and now the child's sent away, it could be a new start for the Abbots. Moving over to prime time. Rourke is currently starring, starring in CW's drama Beauty and the Beast. His role as Kyle Johnson already has quite the fan following. You can learn more about the show by clicking here. And then you can click there. Um, I just go to the link when I upload this, and then you can see the uh, link there. Why are it's weekdays with CBS? Share your thoughts in the comment section below. Additionally, for more on the rest of the sports uh, updates, recaps, and news, go to Soap Hub's Facebook fan page and join the conversation about all your favorite soaps. Um, so, yeah, Travis is going to uh, leave um, New Zealand City for now, from what I'm reading. And I have to say, um, I really was not surprised that he was let go um, from the young Russes as Travis. Uh, since Amal Young has been on uh, YNR as the executive producer, co uh, executive producer uh, with Chuck Pratt, we've seen, um, we actually heard that there will be some uh, departures and returns as well. One of them, uh, Simon Neville, played by Monkey Knight, he's going to leave the show. Cur uh, right, no uh, right now, uh, Travis, played by, played by Michael Rock, is going to leave uh, Genoa City. Uh, Daniel Romali Jr. Um, is going to come back to Genoa City on a limited run on the Russell, so that's good news. Uh, but as far as Travis goes, I have to say I think that there was potential, um, you know, with him as a character to explore his roots, to explore his background, to explore where he came from. You know, how did he uh, uh, grow up in his life? And we did learn a little bit that he was once a part of Wall Street and that he, I think, once worked for uh, Victor Newman, which Victoria found out was furious. But, you know, um, I think once Travis told uh, Victoria his side of the story, you know, Victoria started to believe him a little bit more. And even for me, I felt that there was something there between uh, Travis and Victoria. But I think that the way uh, the writers, and this is when uh, Jill Fern Frost was on uh, YNR, you know, when she... Um, when uh, Travis came to the city, they had Travis and Victoria meet in a bar. And, you know, uh, some felt that Victoria was being trashy, having kissing or love scenes in a bar where it's public and anyone could possibly walk in. But luckily, none of that happened. Uh, but, you know, um, as far as Travis goes, I think um, I think he'll um, come back to the city because it said because um, he asked that question in the end. Um Michael Rock teased, will he come back for his girl? And that's the question. I think that there was a, qu a possibility that Travis could come back to Noah City on, run on the uh, Unrustless. Could he come back as a recast? I mean, that's always possible because, you know, um, once a uh, actor leaves a role, uh, you know, whether it's uh, CBS, ABC, NBC, whoever of the daytime section of, the, of that company wants to, and also powers to be, wants to recast by using a different actor for that role. Um, so I will not be surprised if Travis does does come back. 
Um, but I will be disappointed though if they have building Victoria together. I think that having Travis there for Victoria was a clean, fresh break. Because I said before in previous videos, even the one I did uh, earlier today, the ship has sailed for Billy and Victoria. And I, I just don't see the chemistry. I don't see, I just don't see a lot of chemistry between, uh, you know, Jason, um, Jason Thompson who plays Billy now and Victoria Henley. Not, not Victoria, but Amelia Henley. I just don't see the chemistry there. So, but I'm not surprised there because we all know that the powers to be and writers and everyone else have been shoving this down our throats. And there are going to be some disappointed Philly fans, Philly fans, uh, Phyllis and Billy fans who, who are disappointed if they don't get their couple together. Because, you know, Billy and Phyllis have been having this little, I guess you would say, uh, you know, a cat and mouse game going on between the two of them as well. Even though, even though, uh, even though I think for Phil, she's trying to be more careful about you know not trying to hurt Jack, but she actually she's already have done it. I mean she, uh, she's already done it before. So um, yeah, but anyway, um, I think Michael Rourke will do will be just fine. He's gonna be on Beauty and the Beast. I have not seen her show, but I've heard it's pretty good. Um, so maybe I'll catch an episode of him there. And um, I wish you nothing more best and screaming forward. But some of the guys, you think about this? Do you like it? Do you not like it? Um, are you in the middle of neutral about um, seeing, possibly seeing the last of Travis in Genoa City? And if so, tell me in the uh, screenshots down below. Don't forget to let this video and if you always subscribe to my channel, guys. And until next time, it's Dan saying peace, take care. I will see you guys there for sure coming up tomorrow morning or. In a couple minutes, so stay tuned. So, also, it's time to care, guys. I'll see you guys later. Peace. I'll see you guys later for a coming up in a little bit. So, as always, stay tuned. Bye.